Benjamin Franklin says, life's tragedy is that we get old too soon and wise too late. So I think you should get life experience as soon as possible because the 1850s are right around the corner. The best way to live your life is to get a job. So today I'll be showing you how to ace a job interview as a chef. This will only take a few simple steps, but first I need a volunteer. Hmm, where will I find one? Huh? Hey you! Hey what? Wanna learn how to ace a chef job interview? Only if I make the cut. Step one, know how to cook. Step two, acquire a chef-esque wardrobe. Well, that'll be as easy as mixing water and oil. Not like this. See, wasn't that easy? Nice! Step three, acquire your needed materials, which include a spatula, a whisk, a knife, and a job resume. What's the job resume for? Well, it's a job interview. Oh. What are the whisk and the spatula for? Well, it's a cooking job interview, so you'll have a cooking assessment. What is a cooking assessment? Well, it's a cooking job interview, so I would guess yes. Oh, what about the knife? The knife is for if your job interview isn't going too well and you think the interviewer needs to take a, a long dirt nap. Nice! Step four, stay confident and keep good eye contact. This shows you respect the person who you're being interviewed by while showing that you have poise and maturity. Sure I am of this, that if you keep these steps up, you're gonna get the job. Okay. Step five, make them want you. Use persuasive sayings and tell them that you don't just need them, they need you. Finally, step six, better your life. Don't just make the food, make sure the food makes you. Take that job and run with it. And that's how you're gonna ace this job interview as a chef.